Hey guys and welcome! Today the official Battlefield Twitter account finally ended the weeks of radio silence and posted a whole thread with news to the next set of updates and their content. So here's a short overview of everything we can expect to change in Battlefield 2042 in the coming weeks and when the updates will drop. And the first one, which is update 3.2, will already come tomorrow alongside the new weekly missions. It will mostly contain small fixes that are focused on improving the stability of the game and also adds full XP and weapon progression to more portal servers. In addition, it will then also be possible to complete the weekly missions in Portal. But more details about this and also the full patch notes for the update will be available later today, so I will either do another video about this in the evening or explain this even further with tomorrow's video about the weekly missions. The next update will then be coming in late February and will bring a completely reworked scoreboard that is more similar to the scoreboards we had in former titles and that provides more info about both teams. The player, match and ribbon overview stays almost the same, only that it switches from the right to the left side of the screen and in addition we get an overview of all 64 or 128 players in the match alongside their score, kills, assists, revives and so on. The only thing that is different to the former scoreboards is that it's not split up into the different teams, but the players are marked in blue, red or green instead. I think that's a good way to provide all interesting player details and definitely better than the scoreboard we have right now. And they also wrote that they will further improve the scoreboard after this update depending on the player feedback, so we might see even more improvements here. And the last topic that was mentioned is the matchmaking preferences in All Out Warfare and a voice chat option for all platforms. Right now there are no further details about it or when it will be added to the game, but it's on top of the list and they are working on it, which is good news already. So I'm more than happy that this radio silence has ended and that they keep us informed about coming updates and what the development teams are working on. And I hope to see some good improvements and new content added to the game that will make players return to it. And that's it for now. Like I said, I might be back with more details to update 3.2 today or latest tomorrow alongside the new weekly missions and portal rotation. If you don't want to miss any new video, be sure to drop a like and subscribe to the channel to stay tuned. Until then, thanks for watching. I'm the Catwoman and you are awesome.